Hey guys, the Cajun Crippler, Code of the Bow, and today we're going to talk about bar tricks. Now, I love, love, love bar tricks, or bar stunts, or bar bets, or whatever it is you want to call them. It's a little moments when you're out having a few drinks with your friends, and somebody um, has had a few, and you look at them and you go, you know what, I bet you five bucks that I can do this. Or, I bet you five bucks you can't do that. And then you uh, take the five bucks, you do a stupid human trick with it, and then you get to go, you know, and show off, and people think that you're awesome for five minutes. Those are always so much fun to me. So the first one that I'm gonna talk about is one of the most basic ones, which is how to open a bottle with a dollar bill. And uh, I'm, I'm, I'm still shocked that people don't know how to, how to actually do this, which I think is kind of funny. But it's actually a very easy trick to learn how to do. And uh, it's, it's, it's a good way to make $5 off of one of your friends while you're out at the bar somewhere. It's really, really fun. So what, uh, what you do is you wait till about 1130 at night. You find a friend that's had a few. Uh, perhaps his friend's kind of, a, kind of a rube or a mark or a pigeon if you're a carny. And um, you go, you know what? Uh, Keith, let's say, I bet you... $5, I can open this Coke bottle using only that $5. And Keith will go, what? And so what you do is you have to make a big show of it. See, people do these tricks and they just immediately do them and it's not as impressive. So like me, uh, I want to uh, ensure that I'm playing completely fair. So I wear more rings than the Pope, as, as you can see. So what I do with this trick is I slowly take all of my rings off. I look at people how is this possible what's going on good to see you let people see my hands pass my rings aside now I show my hands there's nothing up my sleeves right and then I take my currency out of uh, whoever's wallet or they hand it over to me this isn't a trick bill is this a trick bill sir no it's not because of course I mean you don't really need one. So what you do is you take that long edge and you make a little crease right along that long edge. And you make another crease along that same long edge. And then what you do, I think a good little rule of thumb is to actually do it one more time. I mean, there's a few different variances to do it, but I really like when it's nice and tight. So then get it like on the surface of whatever, and get it mashed down nice and hard because you want it to be as thick as possible, no air between the spaces in the bill itself. So that's gonna look like that. And then what you do is you make little tiny folds, maybe about half the length of your thumb. And then you kinda Again, you get it nice and tight along every single fold right there. Just like that. And now what you have is a piece that's much thicker. You can get it down, mash it down. Get that little piece right there. You have a nice little bottle opener right there people don't even realize. Now, the biggest mistake that people make is they try to pivot. They try to grab it and then open it like a regular bottle, right? What you gotta do with it is it's like throwing a punch. You have to go through it. So, so you grab it like that, you get it nice and tight and firm. You're gonna pull straight up. You're gonna grab onto that neck and you're gonna pop it right out, just like that. Um, and then you wanna add a little bit of flair, Olay, whatever. Uh, a little Ric Flair woo is always fun, but it's really easy. You just, you know, you, you look left, you look right or whatever, and then you grab that, you get right in behind, and you... <clears throat> Boom. Just like that. And then uh, you sit back. You take a dramatic sip of that, and then you unfold your winnings very slowly, and you look around, you take in the cheers and the 
shocked gasps of everyone else at the bar, and you unfold it, and you say, thank you very much, Keith. And then you drink your beer. Although I'm not actually having a beer this morning because I have to work a little bit later and it's 9 a.m. And, you know, that's probably not a great look. But if you never had a glass bottle Mexican Coke, you absolutely should because those are delicious. All right, guys, we'll see you next time. Uh, hopefully uh, you can use this trick next time you are out at the bar.